What's up, guys? Um, real quick. Um, I don't know if you guys know about the Westboro Church. Um, it's a group. It, it's called the Westboro Baptist Church. Baptist, right? Um, it's a group of people. Um, I think they're from Kansas. I'm not sure. And um, they, they're a bunch of people that are against soldiers. And they actually go to people's funerals, like of a soldier's funeral, and actually have, they protest, they just stand there and tantamount, they freaking torture, like make these people, the family miserable. Because they have um, signs that say, thank God for dead soldiers, or God hates soldiers, or like thank God for IEDs, IEDs mean, means uh, bombs like the bombs in Iraq or Afghanistan, whatever. So they're, they're happy that these soldiers are dead. So they actually go to the person's funeral. They actually like uh, researched, uh, research all, the, all of the soldiers' funeral, and they try to go there. They actually travel far to even, you know, to tantalize these people. So uh, there was just a funeral yesterday morning. Um, it was... Postpone, postponed to yesterday instead of Wednesday. It was originally on for Wednesday morning, but since they found out that these Westboro people were going to be here, they changed it to Thursday. Um, another thing is that the funeral was inside post. It wasn't outside. So even if they got, if the Westboro people were able to get inside of the post, they would not be able to protest in front of the church. So... A bunch of army wives, of course. I I didn't go because you know I I'm not gonna deal with that stuff. I wanted to go, but I don't know. I, I, it's just not for me. <laughs> I was thinking of actually recording it if they were there, but uh, what happened was people, a lot of army wives, like uh, maybe like forty army wives went to went in front of the main gate of the base and actually had their signs supporting the troops and everything. And um, it came out on the news that they didn't end up coming. So it was like an accomplishment because they always have to go to these funerals. And it was the first time they would come to Colorado Springs and, you know, mess up the whole funeral. So if you want to look up about the Westboro Church, they even have their own website called GodHatesFags.com. Can you imagine that? So they have their whole freaking schedule of each funeral, the date, the time, and which place. It's really crazy. And um, they even have videos of them like burning the Quran and stuff. It's really crazy. But um, I'm going to post the links of the, uh, of the topic of the situation that happened yesterday. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm glad that they didn't come and ruin that shit. Um, I can't believe people are like that, you know. Um, <coughs> Another bad thing, Abby, she's protecting the house. She saw some dude go in the clubhouse. But anyways, um, the the bad thing is that um, those people's sons and daughters, they're actually raised to hate soldiers and to, you know, be that kind of person that those people are. So that's really sad about it. Um, it's sad the way that those kids are going to grow up. Hopefully they grow up to realize that their parents are wrong you know and what they're doing is not okay so yeah um i'm gonna cut this short tell me what you think and leave a comment goodbye